Good Fight BJJ is going to bring you the next lesson in our headlock prevention. And if you like this lesson, let's hear it in the comments below. Tell us what you like. Tell us what you would like to see in the future. But here we go. We started looking at the headlock prevention and we talked about our hands being our first line of defense. Okay, get a good base there. Okay, good. Uh, bend your knees. Good. Your hands are your first line of defense. So I can't get around and grab you in a headlock when you have this, this defense here, right? But if I beat this defense, now you're susceptible to getting your head wrapped up. So as I step in front, look, I beat your arm, I come in, I close the space with my hip, and now, hold on one second, now you're in danger of getting your head caught in the headlock. So ideally, the first line of defense, we already talked about that, right? But now I beat this, so this is no longer an option, and I come in and now I have your head, so you're looking for this arm, right? That's what you're going for. The next thing you need to do is bend your knees. Bend them, bend them. Love more, your knees. These are your knees. Bend them. More, more, more. Good. Get your hips up against them. Excellent. Straighten this arm out. Freeze. I'm going to try to pull my hands together. You don't let me. Good. You're pretty strong. When you lock this arm out, this becomes a very strong lever point. And it's hard to stop it. Josiah, come on in here and grab her in a headlock with this arm. Good. Right. Well, if you're going to grab somebody in a headlock, you're not going to stand here like this. Try to grab your hands together. Yeah, right, right, right. All right, go back. Do it again. Okay, so it looks like this. Watch. So we're here. I go to grab you in a headlock. Right. Good. Again. I'm going to try to grab my hands together. Got gotcha. you. All right, here we go. I'm going to give it to you now so you can learn it. Slow motion. Good. Lock your arm out. You see how I'm fighting to grab my hands together and you're locking this arm out? This is what you want. But look, you can still get clipped over. So it's not just this. Straighten this arm out. It's not just this. It's your base. Bend your knees. Knees bent. Bend them. Use your knees. Bend them. Good. Base. If you don't have base, you're going to fall right down to the mat. Important that you have base. I mean, you say base. Base. Say it loud. Base. Base. All right, here we go. <sighs> Okay, lock your arm out, freeze. Get your base, low. Get your hips against me. Now get your head into me this way as well because you don't want me to crank your neck down. Keep your neck nice and solid. Hold this tight. Very, very good. Josiah, come on in, get in here. Step in front of her. Freeze. Lock your arm out. Okay, Josiah, I want you to bend your knees a little bit. Very good, very good. Now, try to push your hands together. Freeze. All right, not bad, not bad. You did it. It took him a little longer to get his hands together. Try it again. Ready? Step in front of her. All right, stop right there. You're not pulling your arm away. Come on, come on out. Let me let me get in here. When I go to when you go grab somebody in a headlock, watch. You don't go like this to grab somebody in a headlock. When you're gonna grab them, they're gonna come in and want to smash you like this, right? So watch, when I come in, you're going to help her learn. Not here and there, and we're not going to let you get it. No, it's going to come in. You're going to try to grab your arms and lock your arm out. Get your base, base, base. Lock this out. Right. I'm trying to help her learn. Now, see how the elbow bends? You see this out at YouTube world? Bend your elbow. Grab my wrist. Who wins? You. Why? Because her um, hand is bent and her um, elbow is going to be able to push to the bends. Right. Whoever the strongest person is wins. Bend your elbow again. Hold my wrist. If you're stronger than me, you can essentially use your power to push my hand away with your elbow bent. But if I'm stronger than you, I'm going to get in and grab my hands together. So jujitsu is about creating leverage. Make your arms straight. This changes the game. It gives you... 10 times the power. That's why you got to get your elbow straight. It makes sense? Mm -hmm. So I come around your head, watch. Now straighten your elbow. Keep it locked. Look. Do you see how much more power you have? Mm -hmm. All by straightening your elbow. Now bend it. Now try to keep my hand away with it bent. <laughs> you can't, can you? Straighten your arm. Now do it. You see the power? That's why you're going for that. 
Now, I want to show you this little exercise here. Do you see how I'm going to try to tilt you over? Bring your feet apart, bend your knees. Now, you see how I try to tilt you? It's a little harder. So this is the idea, is you get into base immediately. Immediately get into base. Like this. Lower on your knees. Lower. Always go lower than you think you want to go because it's going to help to overemphasize. Here, get my wrist because I'm trying to grab, lock it out. Go up. Your knees are starting to come up. Bend your knees. Keep your neck straight and keep your hips on me. Beautiful. Very good. Now, push my wrist back. Come inside. Grab. Keep your knees bent. Keep your head up. And now grab my wrist. Very, very good. Pin it against your shoulder. Okay, not bad. Just so I get in here because we're going to try to help her out. Go ahead and grab her. Mmm, you had the hand. You had the line of defense with this arm. But this scenario is, I mean, this is ideal, but this scenario is he beats this line of defense and he comes around your head. Nice and slow so you can help her learn. Very good. Freeze. Freeze. Lock this out. Is your base low? Check your base. Push it back, and now feed this arm in to grab. Freeze. Your thumb is here, and now with both hands, pin it against this hip. Freeze. Keep your chin and neck straight. Relax. All right, relax. Here, pin. Step your foot out. And now get your base and look up. No, 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 don't bring your head out. Look up here. And now come out. Not bad. Not bad. Very good. Give me five. That's pretty good. That's good. Now watch. I'm going to come in. I'm going to try to grab him. Good. Base. Push it back. Go inside. Now freeze right here. Bend your knees a little bit. Keep your spine and your head straight and your head into me as best as you can. Good. Now take this hand, grab my wrist, pin it against your chest. Freeze right here. Excellent. Yeah, I can feel your hips, so that's good. Now step your right foot back and look up at the ceiling. And now come out. Good. The only thing I would probably correct there is you might be going out a little too far. So the base is going a little too wide. Let's try it again. I come in. Good. See the strength you have here with the, oh, don't bend it. Keep it locked out. See that strength? Okay, go. Freeze. I can't get my hand out. Before I decide to move this hand and push your face away, before I decide to do that, grab my wrist. Pin it to your chest. Freeze. Hold it tight. Yeah. Now, freeze. You see, let me get this one. You see the space you've created? Step this foot back just a little bit and look up to the ceiling. Look at more space you've created. Now get my arm back. Now you can come out. Bring your head out and grab the wrist. Good. Now there's going to be a motion we're going to do for this movement. So I want you guys to do this motion with me. You come on over here. We're going to stand like this and hold the wrist like we got the wrist. Okay, bend our knees. What we're we going to do, we're going to step out and look away. And now you're going to move your left leg back and come out. Because you're going to step in base and you're going to step in base. You're always stepping into some type of base. We don't want to get ourselves off balance and then try to wiggle our head out, but now we're out of base. So when we bring our head out, we're moving our feet as well. So it's here, one, and then we're going to move two in base. Okay? All right, we're in here. Good here, freeze. Now you gotta secure this, stop. You're in base, now step back and look up at the ceiling. Now move this one back. The one I was tapping, good, except you didn't move it. I don't think you moved it. Try it again. I come in here, too slow, do it again. Ready? Okay, you're quicker now. Straight, good, grab here, freeze. With your eyeballs looking down, I can still crush you a little bit. Get some strength in your spine and in your neck. Good. Now you got to move this leg and you move back. Now, and now this one come out. All right. Not bad. The tricky part is you're getting this, but you're not connecting this. Try it again. 
So what I want to have you do, pretend you have my wrist here. You're going to bend your knees in base, right? Bend your knees. You're going to step back one, and then that one comes out two. So it's like this. One, two, as you dip your hand. One, try that. One, and now you're dipping your head out too. All right, so let's try it once again. Good, use your base, 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 right, right, right. Step back, one, two, better, much better, much better. Hannah, come on in here. Do one more with Hannah, go ahead and try to grab her. Good, all right, go back again. Remember, you don't grab like a headlock like this. Nobody does that, all right? You gotta come in and try to grab your hands together. Help her get success. The idea, freeze. Now, if this is a common scenario. Look at this YouTube land. This is a common scenario. You go for the wrist, but you end up in a, like a V block here inside the elbow. Watch what you're gonna do. You're gonna go down the slippery slide. It's like a slip and slide. Slide down and grab the wrist. So when you defend this headlock, relax, relax, let go. When you defend the headlock, you end up here. Go ahead and grab this elbow. Slide it down. So it's here to here. Now bend your knees, Hannah. Good. Grab the wrist. Oh, my fault. Push it back. Get this. Now grab his wrist. Bend those knees. Good. Step this foot back. Look up at the ceiling. And now bring the other foot back. You got it. Good. All right. That was a lot of work. That's what jujitsu is. You got to work. Uh, we've got headlock prevention. You should be able to get out of. We should go down to the playground right now. See if we can get you in a fight. <laughs> no, we're not. We're not going to do that. But look, if you ever get in a situation at a playground. Remember, one of the number one holds that a bully's gonna try to do is gonna try to put you in a headlock. Now you have an escape, and guess what? You didn't even punch his lights out. You were able to get away without inflicting much harm on him. That's the essence of jujitsu. All right, thank you for watching. If you liked the video, let us know in the comments below. We wanna hear from you. Tell us what you wanna see next. But leave us a thumbs up, leave us a good comment. Make sure you subscribe. We'll see you on the next Good Fight BJJ video.